So there's a suite of software for film editing on stale on Steam this week, and I was going to give that a try for editing tonight's Vita. But it's already quarter after 11, so I just want to get this done and get to bed, so we'll give that a try tomorrow. Good evening everyone, and welcome to Day 25 of Vita. My name of course is Artemidge, and today I've got a bit of a difficult topic that's a fair bit of speculation that came to mind today. I went up to Black Knight Games for the weekly Infinity Night. After everyone got done their initial games, a few of us were just kind of standing around talking, and it brought up discussion in regards to both the Warcore program and the now defunct uh, Press Ganger program that Privateer Press had in place. Now, apparently, it's not been an uncommon circumstance for a number of people in these volunteer positions to be deciding that their lack of compensation is going to mean that they quit doing events. Or for them to gain a sense of elitism at being one of the individuals involved in these programs. Frankly, to me that really speaks of not being so much interested in the game in as much as what the game or the company can get you. Now to me these are roles that people should decide to take on because they feel that someone needs to be out there evangelizing their games. Now absolutely, Privateer Press does have one of the more popular ones with War Machine and Hordes, right up there with Games Workshop's Warhammer uh, offerings. Infinity at this point is still a much smaller game and I would say needs its War Cores and its War Core program to get more attention out there and really step up. I myself have recently submitted an application to be a War Core and I intend to make good on it. People have to consider before they put into these programs. Gaming overall is not a niche thing any longer. Tabletop gaming, particularly miniatures gaming, still is. There is a time requirement in looking up your rules, making sure you have those down memorized, because you aren't working with the same pieces on a board that everyone else is. You are building something specific. You have to ensure familiarity with your own units, with the interactions with other rules, both that you are expecting to encounter and you're trying to build a counter to, as well as the way that other units of your own might affect the way those troopers act. As much as I absolutely believe that people should be compensated for their efforts, if you aren't finding that compensation in these programs in that you have new people to talk to and discuss these games with, and to play with regularly, then I have to wonder why you looked into this at all. My experience with people in these programs is very limited. I know a few war cores, but it's through Infinity Knights of Black Knight, so I've met them first as players as opposed to ambassadors of the games. The press gangers I've met through War Machine, again, at Black Knight, as gamers, not as ambassadors of a game. The only person who I could say I technically met as an ambassador of a game first was the free rider who I think that was what the program was GW had anyways the free rider who I met at Torcon 3 back in 2003 who was actually a friend of a girl I was dating at the time these games sadly right now are quite fragile they've never been healthier but we're not at a point where I would say you can just expect the industry to carry itself for any of the titles. Be you somebody who plays something relatively obscure like Beyond the Gates of Antares or the recently kickstarted Maelstrom's Edge, or one of the more established fairs from Games Workshop or Privateer Press. If you want these games to be here for you tomorrow and the next day and two years from now and ten years from now and to possibly teach these to your kids and your friends' kids and new players for ages to come, then everyone who's interested needs to devote themselves to the games. There are going to be issues with the games, there are going to be things to dislike, and if you stop liking something, stop playing it. But don't destroy the community through your own frustrations. That's all I've really got to talk about tonight. Unfortunately, it's not a topic I really wanted to cover, but I feel something needs to be said somewhere along the way. So I hope everyone has themselves a great night, take care of yourselves and each other, and I will talk to you tomorrow.